Hello and welcome back to New Year, New Game. This is where I attempt to play 365 games in my Steam library that I have never played before. This is game 118, Mega Man Legacy Collection. Uh, part 1, because there's two parts to this. Um, I gave the game a thumbs up, and I mainly gave it a thumbs up for legacy reasons, because it's just a legendary classic game that I don't feel deserves to get a thumbs down. Even though I'm absolutely terrible at the game and I was raging and fuming and not happy with the outcome of my many, many deaths. Some that came very quickly, some that were just prolonged damaging of myself until I got to the boss and just died. I did not like it at all and was one of the reasons that's probably put me off from playing Mega Man. My very first Mega Man game was one of the X games and it was either X6 or 7 on the PlayStation and I played that and did not like it. And it was from that point that I realized I'm not a big fan of platform games because I've gone on to play many platforms after that and I'm just not good at them and not willing to keep dying and losing over and over again to play a platform game to try and get better at it. I mean, Mega Man 1 and 2 were the only ones we were able to get to. And those ones were mainly designed for arcade machines and to be quarter eaters is the way that I look at it. So it was meant to be difficult. That's how they designed it was to be difficult. And it's not like I want a super easy game that I can just get past and get to the boss and win and hey, everything's wonderful. I do want a bit of a challenge. And this game is definitely challenging. And if I sat down and actually played the game on a controller as opposed to the keyboard, Maybe I could get used to the idea of it, and maybe I could actually beat the game. It does seem beatable. I'm not saying it's impossible to do it. I'm just saying that I get irritated when I die in video games. And that that's pretty much it. That's all that really sums it up, though. Will I play the game again? I'm gonna say no. I will not play the game again. Chances are, yes, yes, I will play the game again. I'm saying no because I'm not happy with the outcome. But yes, it's, it's gonna be one of those games where it's like, I'm never playing this stupid game again. And then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna play that stupid game again. And I'm gonna die and it's just gonna, it's gonna be a, a vicious cycle of emotions for me. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's something that is definitely gonna wind up happening. Cause there are still, let's see, Mega Man's uh, three through five is on there. And then Mega Man, uh, was it 6 through 11 is on Legacy Collection 2, which is still need to purchase Legacy Collection 2. They also have the X games. I'm going to purchase those. If they made Zero into a collection series, I would purchase that too. Actually, I think they did. I'm pretty sure it's on my wish list. Um, I've got Mega Man Legends on my PlayStation 3. I was able to purchase that digitally because purchasing a physical copy of that game is ridiculous it is so expensive don't even get me started on the Tr tron body adventures and they did just make the uh, mega man nt warrior collection which i definitely plan on getting i'm just kind of on the fence of whether or not i'm getting this for my switch because i want a physical copy or just purchasing it digital through steam and enjoying it that way it, it does kind of hit different though on a handheld as opposed to my computer monitor but I'm going off topic here. Uh, Mega Man Legends and NT Warrior are my favorite Mega Man games. And because this is a classic legacy game that has spun off into many of these different types of games, I have to give it the thumbs up. It doesn't get a thumbs down. It doesn't get a maybe. I would recommend Mega Man to other people who enjoy platform games and struggling and fuming. <sighs> Anyways, I hope that you all enjoy Mega Man. Legacy Collection, here on New Year New Game. Alright, well you're gonna go for OG Mega Man. We're gonna go fight Guts Man first. Jump. 
Just gonna get hit by all. Oh. Thought that was something I could go across. Never played the original. Mega Man. supposed to hit this guy if they keep blocking wow right through it's a reason I don't play platformers I'm not good at them charge the Mega Buster just yet. Wow, that was quick. As soon as I stepped off the platform. Uh, maybe stage select. This is just not for us. Uh, let's go against select, man. Stops it. Uh, yep. Those damn little Roombas. Oh, they go faster when you get onto their platform. Great. Hate these Roombas. timing on this is just terrible for me. I am not good at this game. The only e Mega Man game I have ever played is X. And it was like X 6 or 7? Yeah, we're just gonna die. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done here. I wanna go already. Just kill me. Yep. And then we just fall off the platform. <laughs> oh my god. I jump and I hit the platform above me and it like stops me. Or we just fall off like it doesn't register the button. And it's not like I can take the time to really get all of them. I have to jump, and then you can just hit it when it stopped. Ugh. It's what the pinnacle of gaming was. I wish it would let me use my controller. I have no idea why it is I can't use my controller. I even have a, a Genesis controller that I could plug in too and use. But it will not register, will not read it. For whatever reason. 
I have to use like this third party program in order to get it because most games seem to only want to accept a uh, Xbox controller. Hey, we made it up here. There we go. Only lost like half our life. Should just be smooth sailing from here, right? Does this do anything? I don't even know how I'm supposed to get up on this. Without that, getting hit. Oh my god. I don't get why he can't just destroy him. Why can't you destroy them? Let me shoot him again and just destroy it. Why does it have to stay? Ah. Uh. No stage select. We're just bad at all of them. Let's go fight Cut Man. I'm gonna cut you with my scissors. Hey, hey, hey. All right, this is happening. Yep. 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 Just gonna, we're just accepting this. I actually managed to kill that one. And look, they're back again. At least these ones you can defeat them. The other one. Duck? Nope, they get defeated. There's an auto fire button. It's 
These guys sure do take a lot of hits. Ah, sneeze. Yeah, let's see, my favorite Mega Man game is NT Warrior. And it's not a platform game like this. I think that was the only reason I liked it. Is because I've played X before. I don't think I've played any of the other Mega Man games. Just the uh, X version. And, um... I don't like it, because, well, I died. All the time. And that's something that can, like, you know... Turn you away from not playing a game is, is not winning at the game. <laughs> or not even having a good time, because there's some where it's like you uh, lose and things like that, and it's still pretty funny. Like Mortal Kombat, you don't win. You get the fatalities and things like that. It makes it just a bit entertaining. It still can get irritating with Mortal Kombat, because of course you want to beat the game. And if you're not, and you're always getting like beat by Goro or... Shao Kahn or somebody like that, then, uh, yeah, I can see how it could not be fun. But for, like, platformer games, I think that's just been, like, my biggest struggle. I should have shot. That was my fault. It was just not being good at games. Oh, wish they didn't start me here. Don't go there. Go here. But I always liked Mega Man as uh, a character. Just the concept of him and everything was really cool. The fact that like he could uh, get the powers of his enemies after beating him. That concept for a character I was really digging. I was into that. I don't know why I bothered shooting that guy. I could have just gone in advance. Look out for the scissors! Patterns are so unorthodox! Spikes, wonderful. Ow. There. Oh, they just keep going. It's better just to run away from those things. Oh, what the heck are you? Ow. Right before the boss fight. I'm surprised we even made it this far. Oh, it's not the boss fight. Ow, ow, ow. Now it's the boss fight, isn't it? Oh, they got me. We lose! 
no, stage select. We're just gonna keep going around the stage. I know that there is a specific uh, recommendation to how you should be doing the stages, because certain uh, powers are stronger against other robot masters. So, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> It's the fact that they come back right away, too. Oh, we slide around here. Can't Mario it. Gotta shoot him. If anything, if they just keep coming back, do one eventually drop health? Could I do this to try and get some health? Hit him in the face. Instead of in his pants. No. Yep. Yep, hit the Roomba. Yep. Gonna hit something. Can't can't avoid it, apparently. Because they just keep coming. Ah, oh, we slid into it. I can shoot through these things. Thing takes a lot of shots. <laughs> we down the poop shoot. Uh, oh, I was like, how the heck? Okay, all right. This is gonna. I'm gonna really not like this. Yep. And uh, the Roomba's taking me out. Can't beat the Roomba. Stage selects. Let's move on. I absolutely do not like that stage whatsoever. Of course, I haven't liked any of the stages yet. I say yet, like I'm eventually gonna run into one that I am gonna like. I don't. I don't think that's possible. <laughs> Part of me has always been like, why don't I just stay in the area and, you know, fight the things. Till they stop spawning in. They don't stop spawning in. There's ones that just keep going. Much as I want to be a stop and fight all of them kind of person.
Ah, that went off. Oop, and there's no ducking. Platformers, I don't like you. Can't stick on the platforms. Just always slightly off. Now... Glad we can do this, at least. Yep, I'm just gonna let you. You get a free one for that one. There we go. Looks like I'm gonna slide off into the spikes. Oh, Sniper Joe! What did they hit me with? Oh, they blow up because they're bombs. That makes sense. That definitely makes sense. Oh, ow. Oh, come on. That's just not my nice. Right spawns right at the ladder at the entrance. And then just keeps going and keeps going and keeps going and keeps going. Ow! Arg! Gonna say, I'll just say to hell with it, because he's gonna die, and there's gonna be another one who spawns right away. Oh, on the spikes. Felt like I was close enough to that ladder. Wow, didn't even jump. Didn't even jump. Just slid right off the platform, that one. Great. That's, that's wonderful. Got a lot further on that one. Alright, fine, man. Let's see. I'm gonna hit your stage too. Can already tell. We lose to everybody. I think we can just move on to uh, Mega Man 2. I haven't played Mega Man 2 either. I was gonna do each game individually, but I, I honestly don't think I will be coming back to play any of the games. I think games like Mega Man are the reason I don't like platforming games. And it's really just my own skill. Not saying like, oh, the game's bad and not built well. I'm just not good at the game. Oh, wow. It's like, I don't want to get jumped too far and hit that flame. That'd have been a real shame. I bet he can't do, like, a crouch shot. Yep, that's just the, all the wrong button. Ow! Ow! Oh, okay, they just kind of, like, follow me over. Oh, boy! Oh, no! Let's keep trying to move. Let's keep going up.
Boop. Boy, the timing on this thing is like, what, one second? Seems like one. Oh boy. How am I supposed to get up there? It's like catch on the way down, that'll work. Nope. You really don't want me to jump on the lower platform and then get to the other platform before the beam goes off again, right? Yep, that's exactly what they want you to do. Well, if you touch it, it'll hurt you. Even when it's not going. I don't care for those little mega blasters, those things can stay there. Yeah. Oh, maybe it's gonna go fast. Yep. Woohoo, a little slither of hope! That will drastically fade away, though. They'll, they'll get rid of that slither of hope. Yep. Just want to make sure... I don't fall in. Just want to make sure I didn't fall in. Oh, my God. Those things even, like, push you back so far. Oh, come on, jump button. Come on, jump button! Uh, that's everybody. How do I not do this? Let's do that. Let's all tap over and then just go to, uh, make sure this stays. Uh, quit. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. It's fine. Boom! Back to the front. Uh, back. And let's move on to Mega Man 2 and see how much we fail at Mega Man 2. 1988, I wasn't born yet. These games are older than me. What happened to the events of Mega Man 1? Who knows? Um... I guess we'll start here at the top left and work our way around, huh? Start with Bobble Man. Alright. All still the same button. Oh, why? Oh no! Oh! Those platforms go away! Shooting those little frogs! Not that easy. It's not just, oh my god, they have such a bounce. No, why did you slide off the platform? They're not even slippery! This isn't an ice level. Stop following me. Yep. Yo. Ow. And jump, 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 jump. We did it. Hooray. That's gonna be like, is that where I die? So far, not so bad. I'm gonna jinx it though. We're in a water level now. This is gonna be, uh, of course, right on top of it. Uh, 
or I'm gonna like drown or something. Even though I'm a reploid, even though I'm like a robot, I shouldn't have drowned. I don't have lungs. I have something that resembles lungs that's not quite lungs. I thought those spikes on top were gonna jump down on me. Why can we not kill the fish? Why can I not kill this fish? Do I just gotta keep shooting until these things start stop coming out? I can jump over it. Yo! Oh, apparently not. Damn thing. Alright, let's just keep moving. It's a Metroid! Oh, spikes. Those, those still are spikes. Stage selection. Alright, Airman. Let's see what you got for me. Give me a reason to not like you. See, in NT Warrior, they actually used a lot of these characters again. Oh, really? Drills on the sides? Drills that I can't jump over or shoot? Well, why? Why would you put them on the sides? And give me the smallest little platform that I'm just gonna get knocked off of when those things come and hit me. Missed my opportunity. Ah, got a blocked opportunity now. Yo! God dang it. Yep. That was me. Just jumping to my death. Yeah, let's let's move on. Seems like a good thing to do. Continue. No, not continue. No. Nope. Nope. I can do this. I can just do this. We're moving on. I'm not going any further than this. This is the end for Airman stage. We're done with it. We have failed, and we are going to move on. Um, no. No more. You don't get a second chance. This is just all. We're just all dying. Enjoy just a little bit of beat from the background, the stage music, because this is it. This, this is over. Yep. Stage selection. Honestly, I'm surprised I haven't played any of the classic Mega Man games before. I mean, I didn't have an NES. So it wasn't like... I had access to it. I mean, he was on the Genesis, though. I can't get that. What are those things? How am I supposed to dodge this? Yeah, there's... What? Come on. That slither in here. Those things, those tentacles gonna do to me. <sighs> Taken out by a large stick of butter. They don't jump high enough for me to really shoot them. No dodge, like duck button, to get out of that. There isn't a duck button, right? Like they didn't add that in the suit too. Nope, still no duck. Just <laughs> get sneeze. Let me keep falling. Oh, I landed on the little lip.
Well, Quick Man lived up to his name. It definitely was a quick stage for me to die in. Woodman! There we go. You looked a lot better in an NT Warrior. Besides the guy who just looked like he put a log on himself. Oh, bombs. Bad bombs. shooting carrots at me. Nah. Ah, another one. I just speed run through it. Well, I mean, we tried to do that actually on the quick man stage. That didn't work out for us. Back to full. What is this thing? How do I dodge that? How do I shoot it? And how do I dodge it? It's like little to no time. You just run out of energy at some point? Ridiculous. Oh, another one. Great. It starts me back here. I don't get a checkpoint like the other stages. I hate these things so much. I hate all of you. Everything. Everything here. I hate it. Go away. Ah, carrots. Getting attacked by healthy food. Thrown by a mechanical rabbit. Yeah, you're gonna need one of these for this next thing. Yeah, hit him with that auto fire. Ow. Stop sending these. I don't know what any of this has to do with wood or the forest. The theme is not fitting very well. What is this? Oh, Donkey Kong. Oh, and a bunch of little ones come out and knock me off the stage! <sighs> this is ridiculous. For the very few moves that you're given for Mega Man, you expect him to do a whole hell of a lot. For a three-button game. Ah! Ah! 
Ah, another one! Get out of here, you parts! Oh my god, oh my god! <laughs> they platforms! Back underground, because that's where Woodman is. Yeah, just get up close to him and auto fire. It's all I'm learning. And hope they drop a health after I kill him. Hey, we're back into the underground forest. dodging goes. Now we get to reach Woodman and actually fight him. Stage selection. We actually reached one of them. Crash Man. This is what I'm about to do on your stage. It's just crash. See the leaves falling. Leaves coming towards me. I don't know what I'm doing. These things are just getting closer to me. Oh, why do you bring them back? Don't bring them back! Ah, I hate you! I hate all of you! How am I supposed to get on the ladder if they're always gonna be spawning? Just to knock me off! Press the jump button! Like this game just wants you to let them hit you. Just let them hit you, so just let them. There is no perfect run. There is no not getting hit by anything. Not everything is one hit. Uh. Oh, these guys again. At least this one stayed open. I'll play EXE and Mega Man Legends all day, but these, this one, no. You do it! Oh, he did it. platforms. Hate platforms so much. Can't, can't reach that. 
Guess we'll just keep shooting. Get the ladder! There we go. <sighs> Alright, what are you? What the hell are you? There we go. Just got to shoot it in the face. Just a bunch of paint cans come shimming it over to me. Robo paint cans. Oh, don't you do it. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. There. Yup. I hate you. I don't think there is a dodging for this. Yep. Ah, uh, yeah, because you jump, you get hit by the top beam. You stay, you get hit by the middle beam. You shoot back, you're still going to get hit by the beam. No. And he's just going to be back there when I get back up there. This is not a win. No! Oh! Just gonna crawl this ladder. Just fucking ladder. Just gonna keep climbing up. Just gonna keep climbing up. Just gonna keep going. Just gonna keep getting to the top. So there's another little Met Metroid thing. Ah, don't know what to do there! You can't dodge the attack! No! You have to get hit. There's like no other way around it. You have to get hit. I'm not gonna deal with that one. We're not dealing with you today. You keep climbing. Oh! 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 At least you're not gonna send another one. Oh! oh, oh. Not again! Not again! Not like this! No! <sighs> oh, what are you? Ah! 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 Bird. That goddamn bird. Just keep going. This this is my my punishment. Clearly anything bad that I have done in my lifetime. This is how I'm being punished. Playing Mega Man. I don't even want to say playing. I think playing is loosely saying losing to Mega Man. 
getting destroyed. That Mega Man. Keep climbing. No looking back. Get away from me! Get away, birds! We got it. Yep. 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 Ah! 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 <laughs> That's right. Ah. I'm gonna try the other ladder. I'm gonna go up the other way. It doesn't have that little thing shooting at us. when I jump to that other platform. Yes. Just no not taking damage. There's just not, not a thing. You have to take the damage. You have to be punished. You have to. Punishment's a part of the game. Not Mega Man game without punishment. There's no, like, angle to shoot either. Left, right, those are your only options. gotten up there for absolutely nothing. Well, that's an extra life, isn't it? I'm not trying to prolong this. Ugh. Let me die by the boss. Let this be the last stand. You are fast. Alright, yep, he just he moves real quick and he shoots bombs. I don't move so quick. And I get hit by bombs. Flash man! Here we go. This is this is probably the one Mega Man character that's caught many of seizures. They were really, really friendly with those uh, flashes and games. 
in cartoons. Oh, oh, his is the ice level. Yeah, that makes sense. Have a light bulb with a slippery. Ow, ow, ow. I hate this. I hate this so much. <laughs> gonna no we're done we're not doing this right now just through this maze run. Ah, oh, it's another one! Oh! Oh, boy, Slithers. Really? Really? It has to have two? It had, had to make it that, that difficult, huh? I hate platform games so much. I hate them. I hate them so much. Ah, I hate you! I hate you! Ah, and I had to go up there anyways! God! <laughs> Why? Ugh. Ugh. Oh, Slithers. Oh, Slithers. You needed another one? Why did you need to spawn another one? There's already one there! Ah, I hate this place. It's the worst timeline. Metal Man's next. No, oh, it's going the other way. We're gonna reach that. That energy that we can't use. That's gonna drop, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, I can't even go on those parts that's not spiky. It still hurts, huh? Fun! Fun! I like that! I like it's a great mechanic! Well, 
that's an hour. That's an hour. That's an hour. We're done. <laughs> not. I'm not playing anymore. Stop the timer. We're finished with the Mega Man Classic Collection. I have now officially played Mega Man One and Two. That's what I count as playing Mega Man One and Two. I'm gonna gonna actually just go th do this. Quit. Yes, because I wanted music in the background. I am gonna give this game still a thumbs up. Even though I'm absolutely suck at the game, Mega Man is a classic. And as far as I'm concerned, it's got essentially a diplomatic immunity. The game has been around for so long, it has spun off so many different series of Mega Man. I think in just this rendition alone of just Mega Man, there was 10 or 11 games of it. I want to say 11 was the highest. And then you had X, which is a whole different series, kind of plays similar to how this game plays. A little bit of a different life, uh, different style. Lifestyle, sure, it's a different lifestyle. Uh, Zero, which they did that on the Game Boy Advance. That spun off into a whole different kind of series, which was the same kind of like platformer concept. But then you get Mega Man Legends. And Mega Man Legends was amazing. I absolutely enjoyed playing Mega Man Legends 1 and 2. I really, really wish they weren't like over a hundred bucks in order to purchase them. I was lucky enough to snag them in the PlayStation Store on my PlayStation 3 before they shut down that store. And I really hope it's still in my library in order to like install it. Because like I lost Marvel vs. Capcom 2 on the 360 when they took it and removed it from the stores. Now I can't download to play that. And that game too, over 100 bucks. Ridiculous. Great game though. I mean, you've got cartoon series that spun off from this Mega Man series. Mega Man was a character on Marvel vs. Capcom 2, and he was a favorite of mine to use. So I can't just say because of the games. I mean, these are old games. Not to mention, these were like arcade games. They made them difficult on purpose because they just wanted you to feed the machine and give them quarters. Which is why these games were so difficult. They didn't want them to be relatively easy to where you put it in one quarter and you get through the game with no problems. They wanted you to struggle, they wanted you to be hooked to it, and they wanted you to just keep feeding quarters into the machine because you got to defeat that boss. Because you got to just keep going. I, unfortunately, am not that kind of person who wants to keep going. I don't want like a super easy game. Some challenge is good, and I feel like if I wasn't using mouse, well not mouse, but keyboard in order to play this game, I would have enjoyed it better if I could have gotten my controller to work or gotten the Super Nintendo or Genesis controller that I have and plugged that in and got that to work. Couldn't get it to work on this. It's a shame. I would have rather played it with a controller as opposed to with my keyboard. But yeah, it still gets a thumbs up. It's a classic game. It, it has immunity from a thumbs down. I can't give it a thumbs down at all because of just how legendary the game in itself is and there's even a second collection because i don't think this is all of the games on here where they had one two three four five six yeah so they have six here and then seven through eleven must be on the other ones and um there's a second collection not the other ones there's a second collection, so those ones must be on the second collection. And I really would still get that second collection and play it and be angry at it and fail at it. And who knows? Maybe I'll get so mad at the point where I just feel like I have to beat this game now and just go for it. But they did just release Mega Man NT Warrior Collection, and I want to get that. I'm just kind of torn on whether or not I'm getting a physical copy for the switch or if i'm going to be getting it digitally through steam i can get it on steam and most of my games are through steam that's how we're playing this game is through steam but getting it on a switch and kind of having that handheld hits different than having it on steam so who knows at some point though i'll pick that game up and i'll turn that into a let's play series as well because i haven't played all of the nt warrior games i played two or three of them and I really enjoyed it. And I would love to play that game again. Anyways, that is going to do it for me. If you 
would like to play the Mega Man Collection. It is available through Steam, which as I previously mentioned is how I'm playing this. And if it's available through Humble Bundle, I'm going to include a link in the description below. If you click that link and purchase it on Humble Bundle, I get a small amount of your purchase into my Humble Bundle wallet, which I use to purchase more games, because more games is more good. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next game. Goodbye.